Hello everyone, Charlie from WePC. You've not seen me in a while because I've been in the dungeons of editorial. But today is an exciting day because I get to leave the office. We're going down to Razor's HQ, I think, to see the new haptic gaming cushion, the Freya. We're also going to be checking out the Kraken V4 Pro headset. That's the one that works alongside it. So yeah, let's go and check it out, see what they have to offer. We did see the conceptual piece at CES this year, which was pretty cool. A lot of people covered it. We had a little look at it. It was very good. This is the product that's going to be going to market. Um, and my first impressions are it's it's pretty cool little little thing to have, actually. Um, we've only used it for like 15, 20 minutes now. We've had the full demo and um, I can actually see it, it basically works with anything audio based. So music, movies, games, um, apparently Razer are working with a number of developers as well so that they can implement it straight into the game, which sort of takes out your own custom settings and they implement what they would like it to feel like. And so far from today, it's been, it's been really cool. Um, we did some music tests and you've obviously got a ton of things that you can set in the new software that's on its way out. That's going to be launching at the same time on the 28th. We are going to be doing a more full-on review of the products when we get it. Razor are going to be sending us one, so we'll be looking into that. But first impressions are, it's a nice little thing. You can obviously change the intensity. You can crank it right the way up, especially when you're listening to music and, you know, you can, you, your body is pretty much fully vibrating. Um, the headset works alongside the cushion, so you can sort of be fully immersed in whether you're listening to music, movies, or you are, you know, playing your games. And they did show me all the chairs that it was compatible with. There's literally about 50 chairs that it works with. Essentially, the, the aim is for it to be compatible with any chair. So no matter what you've got, whether you're rocking a Razer chair or, you know, a Secret Lab or just a standard little office chair like we've got in here, it should work with that. And overall, um, yeah, um, first impressions, good. Um, we are going to be doing some more for a testing. One thing I'd noticed was um, with some of the gaming stuff, because of the way that I actually play, not my, my back isn't physically touching it, so it feels a bit like whether that's going to be working, but we'll look into that in the, in the more in-depth review. But so far, so good, pretty cool products, and yeah, I look forward to testing it more.